Good morning. I don't know if it started or not. It says live in my little corner, so I'm going to go with that. Um, oh, here we go. Good morning. I am Debbie Duval with Park Lane Jewelry, designer Deb, and I'm so glad you're here this morning. And if you're not here this morning, you can catch it later on the replay. But I have a fabulous tip today. I saw this on a YouTube video yesterday, and I was super excited to share it with you. Um, I've talked and talked and talked about how the messy neck is a really hot trend in jewelry right now. And all that is is a series of small necklaces at the neck. Well, the reason it's called a messy neck is they sometimes get tangled, they sometimes lap over each other. Um, and some of us don't really like that feeling or that. I've got a great tip for you for using two small necklaces and it creates a pulley system that keeps them in place and allows you to adjust just how high you want one or how low or what order you want them. So this morning for my demonstration, I'm gonna use a couple of our very simple um, top selling necklaces. This one is called Craze. And you can see it's a little barrel necklace with all kinds of pave crystals in it, embedded in it. The one I'm using today is silver, however, it does come in gold. And the second one that I'm gonna be using is something I really haven't talked a lot about and I absolutely love this. It's called Happy. And the reason I remember the name of it always is because it's like a smiley face. And one side it's crystals and the other side it is just a smooth a silver bar. And um, those straight bar necklaces are really hot. This just adds a little curvature to it, a little smiley face. Um, and it too comes in gold and silver. Now you can do this tip with any necklaces you have. It doesn't have to be Park Lane, but of course mine are Park Lane. So what you're going to do is take the clasp of one of the necklaces and you are going to attach it to, all of our necklaces have an extender attached to them. So you are gonna attach this clasp to the bottom of the extender where the extender meets the necklace. That's where you're gonna attach it, okay? And then what I have is a really long necklace, okay? And I have a clasp in one hand. I have both necklaces, you can see. And I have a clasp, I'm gonna keep that in my right hand because that's always the easiest to work with. And then I'm gonna go all the way to the end of the extender. And what I'm going to do is I'm gonna put these around my neck and basically double it. Because remember, I have two necklaces that are going on. So I'm just going to wrap it around my neck. And then at the very back, I'm gonna take the clasp and the end of the extender and hook it. Okay, now I have, I'll get a little closer here. Now I have both of my necklaces on. And all I have to do, I have to find the happy and just kind of swing it around because I want that happy place in the front. And of course, everything is opposite here. So Debbie has a little dyslexia with that. And you can see that I have just I'm just able to adjust them. The beauty of this is I can take this and I can now bring that happy necklace way up to be a choker and I can have my craze bobble hang quite low. Or I can do the reverse. I just tug a little on the chain, bringing that craze necklace all the way up to my neck and allowing that happy necklace to fall down to the center. Isn't that fun? And they're gonna stay in place and not become messy. This is just earth shattering to me. It is so wonderful. I've heard some of the other stylists talk about it and somebody even mentioned a pulley system and I really never looked into it until yesterday when I was doing other stuff I always put training videos on. And this was just fantastic. So any two small necklaces, whether they're yours or Park Lane's, and if you don't happen to have any, I can certainly hook you up. But this really makes that messy neck very adjustable. And then when it's done, it's gonna stay in place all day and you're gonna feel really good about your messy neck. I can even add a third layer around it as well and feel really confident that everything's gonna stay in place. So this is designer Deb, hoping your Thursday is going great. 
And that's my tip for the day is how to adjust a messy neck by connecting two small necklaces. I'm having an open house tonight from five to eight at my home. I would love to have anybody come if you want to practice the messy neck, if you want to see some great um, uh, jewelry and sales that I have going on. Right now we have two bonus items. Whenever you purchase $90, you get not only one, but two bonus items, meaning that you get to pick out anything up to $200 for just $30. So for $60, you could get substantially more jewelry, $400 in free jewelry of two gorgeous pieces. So I'd love to help you put some gifts together for family, friends, coworkers, um, or just a surprise for somebody who is going through a rough time. Anyway, Designer Deb bringing you the tip of the day, how to adjust the messy neck so it's not so messy. Bye-bye, have a great day.